The old spinny handle. What up, what up? We're here with the Baseball Bat Bros, and today, folks, we're hitting with what is well known as one of the greatest oddities in baseball bat history, the 2016 good-looking bat, Easton Mako Torque, also known as the Spinny Handle. They told me something new was coming, but it was beyond my expectations. We had the success of the Mako last year. It's in every dugout across the nation. To top it off, we have the Mako Torque, and it fundamentally helps you become a better hitter. I'm taking 200 hacks like this every day, I'm at risk for injury. Because what you really have to do is change position of your hands as you swing. Top hand up and bottom hand down. The standard bat actually prevents you from getting into the power position. Hitters can do things with this bat when their hands are free to rotate that were previously not possible. You can keep your hands inside the ball. Getting you into that hitting position. You can get shorter to it. The second advantage occurs at the end of the swing. It delays the wrist roll. You can go with the pitch. You can stay in the zone longer. And that keeps the barrel on plane with the pitch. It feels like I'm through the zone a lot longer. And now you're delivering that power through a longer range of your swing. And fast forward about a year from the release date, I recall they could not get rid of these things, man. Even back in like 2018 or so, I saw these bats on some retailers' websites for like $75 because people just hated that spinny handle. And we're going to try it out today and see if it's really that bad. I personally think I'm going to hate it, but we're going to give it a shot, folks. The Mako Torque. All right, folks, let's try this thing out. We have the original grip on there, the old spinny handle. And for today's experiment, we're moving forward to the modern day Easton two piece composite BB core. It's a $500 bat and we're going to use this as a baseline to see you know how it swings what kind of exit velo we're sitting at with the wrap soda right there and then we'll see if this was a, a hidden gem or if this was truly a disappointment and we're back out here home of the bend elks vince Gena stadium here's the dimensions freshly turfed looking good high elevation though the ball flies here we're gonna see if we can get a ball in the grocery store out in left field that, that that's a legit like 400 foot bomb Good barrel there. That was 100.5. Yep. There we go. Hammered. Should be right around 100. 99.5. Yep. Pretty good. Ooh. Smoked. Barrel. 101. 100.8. Oh, wow. I'm getting way too good at this. Ah. Go. Boom. Absolute barrel. What do you think? 101.5. 1013. Oh, That's so close. Way too good. Maybe the pine tar will help it spin less. All right, so first problem with this, the point at which it spins isn't even really directly between your hands. Like just regular grip like that. Do you see like my pinky is around the bottom part. You'd have to have really really big hands or be choking up for this to even work properly. We'll start choked up. Wow, that's weird. Dude. Wow. Well, that was super low. That was terrible, 89.5. Yeah, yeah. Like when I'm rocking the bat, it's, rot it's spinning in my hand just like this. Oh, bro. I don't know how any player ever would pick this up for the first time, hit with it and be like, yeah, I like that. That's it's so far removed from everything you learn. The barrel feels good, is, which is what's crazy, but... Ooh, yeah. Dude, there's, I can't turn the barrel because I don't even have a good grip on the bat. Wow, 94 Yeah, I barreled that ball and I just can't throw the barrel like I normally do. All right, I'm going to go down to my normal grip. And well, like, I'm kind of down on the knob a little bit but my pinky or my ring finger is gonna be overlapped on the bottom thing, so maybe it stops it from spinning. Might help. The barrel feels good and it looks dope. Yeah, dude, it's not even, like, that eliminates the spin. I'm actually gonna hit good with this. It still just feels like an insecure grip. 96.1. Bro, no doubt in my mind, it's not even close. The barrel on this is hotter than the barrel on that. 101.6. Yeah. Hot take east and bring that colorway back. Dude, this looks so sick, honestly. I love this colorway. I love it. Oh, gosh. It's just... It almost feels like your hand is slipping off of the bat when you're swinging. Oh, wow. 
hit pretty well. Still like, that might be a hundred. Yeah, it's just, I'm not getting those high velos. I don't have a great grip on the bat. That's a good barrel. I think it would be a good composite bat if you just taped over it. But I feel like even if you taped over it like hard, it would still feel loose almost. Get out, ball. Go, ball. Go, ball. Oh, we got one out with the spinny handle. 95 so it's not it's not going that fast. I just pieced that ball. Okay, I'm gonna choke back up so I get the full spinny effect. I smashed that, but I legit think my velo is so compromised. 97.5. And like okay, in theory, you swing this bat in high school, you swing this bat in college, and you do really well, then you get drafted. Then what? You can't make a spinny handle wood bat. I'm gonna see if we can grip over this. It's not as like bad or disruptive as I thought though, honestly. Like it's, you can hit with it, but it's just like, why would you go out of your way to swing this? If anything, it disrupts your swing. I don't think, like, I definitely wouldn't say it helps. I don't get the point, like what they were trying to do. They were trying too hard to innovate. That's a common problem in the bat world, bro. Same thing that happened with the Mizuno squishy barrel. It's the same thing that happened with the backspin technology and that DeMarini Gattaca. It's like... How expensive is one of those bats online? Oh, this was probably... I mean, it was 2016, but it was... It had to have been 450 at least. I just hope it actually keeps it from spinning. This is like my best tape job I've ever done. It's so smooth and I wasted it on the spinny handle. All right, moment of truth. Does it spin? You, you'll see if my knuckles rotate. It's loose. You can see the wiggle. It's not secure. Let's see though. Ah, oh, it's got it. Still don't like it. Smoke that. Get out. Oh, absolutely. Squeaked it out, but is that even 100? 95.6. Yeah. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I feel like I get, like, my timing's great. I get to right here, and the bat just doesn't completely do what I want it to do. Come on, I got a barrel one. There you go. Good barrel. 95.9. Wow. Oh, almost. Funny thing is, everything else about this bat's pretty good. The swing weight is super light. The barrel feels really big. It sounds great. There we go. That's as hard as I'm hitting it. 99.9. It didn't do anything to help it. No. <laughs> that did nothing to help. You would have to tighten that thing down so much. You, you, you gotta like surgically repair that thing. You can't just throw tape over it. Okay, let's go back to this. Okay, back to the hype for a couple. I wanna make sure I can still hit. Smash. Bye, Roof. Thank goodness. Still not that high velo. I mean, this is a like not super broken in composite. It's not really meant for high velo. That hand. Just a lot more barrel on that ball though. Yeah. I can actually, I feel like I couldn't pull the ball well with that bat. Oh, dude, it's so much better. I, I wouldn't even say I necessarily like this bat that much yet because it's not broken in, but. 103. Yeah. Dude, this is such a relief to hit with this after that. That was like getting in my head. Oh, goodness. Wow. That, 101.6. That bat sucks because <laughs> of the handle. It's a bummer too, the barrel's good. Last one, come on. I'm just gonna forget that it spins. Not moving. A hundred still. Yeah. Oh yeah. Dude, all right. Ninety-nine one. I don't know. It kind of like maybe the more I was swinging, it really stuck down on there because it feels a little more secure. Let's do the last one. See what happens.
one. Yeah, my, the bat does what I want it to do with this. All right, folks, so when I barreled it, it felt great. Uh, even better than that sometimes because, you know, this is just a lot more broken in. It's an older bat, but dude, that spinny handle ruins it. I guess I can kind of see the logic behind it, but uh, that was not fun to hit with, man. <laughs>